Alright, hey guys, it's the last uh, basketball training session that I'm, I'm doing, and we're gonna. I thought we could just do a little bit more fitness into this one, so I thought we could do fast break finishing. So we're gonna start off with a warm up. Yeah, um, come from the half break, half court, and we're gonna finish. We're gonna just finish fast against the uh, fast on the on the fast break layer. Alright. On the warm up, we'll start on the three point line. Alright, make sure we're going. Now, what I suggest is you need to work on trying on your footwork, on your balance, and your coordination, making sure when you're going as fast as you can, you're hitting the light, the backboard as light as you can at the same time. Because your speed is also going to affect the power. Uh, on how you hit the, uh, the backboard. The reason why I only take for now from the three point line is because you're not building that much power. You're just, you're just warming up until you're finishing, stretching your legs. Doing 10 on the right side and 10 on the left. Um, on the left side, you've got three different angles to do it from. So you have it from the middle. I'll suggest even though you're coming from the middle, you're driving down the middle lane, you're still gonna wanna finish on the side, on the diagonal to the bottom, to the, to the rim. You don't wanna ever finish on the middle unless you're dunking it, then have fun, by all means. But if not, if you're not dunking it, it's better for you to finish diagonal to the basket always. Never finish on the middle. Three angles to do it at, diagonal from the three point line, corner, and the middle. Same thing with the right hand. Now, on the first drill, uh, probably you guys can tell because this is fast break finishing. All you're going to be doing is running around for a whole 10 minutes. 10 minutes running around, hard, finishing nice and hard at the, uh, at the backboard on the rim. Just we're going to go around. I'm going to start, you start from the baseline on one side. And you go diagonal to the other rim, and you keep going diagonal to rim to rim, using only two rims. You also want to keep pushing the ball forward so you can build up that pace. Five minutes with just your right hand, and then ten minutes, five minutes with just your left. Damn. After you do, do the first drill, your second drill, you're gonna implement shooting. So you do a variety, variety, variety of finishing with a layup. Finish with a mid range or finish with a shot. You can do mid range, left, or three point arm. Either way, just finish strong. I'm gonna do one of each, but I'm gonna keep doing one of each until I can finish. So I can at least make one of each.
Have you done that? We do that for like five minutes. Feel just as tired as I am. And then, after you do that, on a cool down, I suggest you reward yourself with making 10 laps before you leave the gym. 10 laps, 10 free throws. All right, that's five training programs that you did, that you got from me, Coach Leroy, from RDF. Thank you very much.